So our extended family has this secret Santa every year and we swap around family members. So one family member gives another family member a gift as secret Santa. So this year, my secret Santa was my brother, Eric, and he got me one of these sane logic Wi-Fi weather station. And uh, so I figured I'd have a couple minutes free today, so I'd, I'd go ahead and install it. Uh, and it works pretty well. I was a little bit skeptical, uh, to be quite honest, um, because it doesn't look like it's anything other than just a simple uh, self-contained unit where you've got this plug-in screen and then the screen receives uh, information from this uh, uh, weather sensor that you mount somewhere either on the roof or on a post somewhere you know where it's going to be able to get all the information for rain and wind and whatnot so i went ahead and installed it today and uh, was quite surprised in the fact that this integrates with weather underground so uh, you can continue to use this little standalone piece and not do anything else other than just have it connected to your weather station. And as long as it's about, you know, anywhere less than 80 feet away, these two devices, then this uh, will receive all the information it needs. It basically just gets little blips of uh, updates on the, um, you know, on the data that's coming off the sensor here. So this runs on three AA batteries and maybe say every 10 seconds or so it'll send a quick uh, rf radio frequency over to this unit that's always plugged in and then if you decide to then connect this uh, to the internet then you can integrate it into weather underground and then that becomes a lot more valuable because then you can get these readings pretty much anywhere in the world and also you can share this with friends and family and so forth here is the physical installation of the weather station. I have it mounted at the top of the berm in front of my house. There's the weather station. There it is. I have it mounted right there to a really strong post right next to my security camera and pointing exactly to the south and it's totally unobstructed. So now let's go ahead and connect this to Weather Underground so you can use it on your tablets and other devices. So go online, join Weather Underground. You can create your own account using an email and password it's free and then once you've created that account go into your member settings and then my devices and within that my devices area you can add a new device once you've clicked that button you're gonna see a drop-down screen with a number of manufacturers this one seemed to work just fine they're sort of agnostic about what device you use so once you set that up, it's going to give you a unique ID and a unique key, which is a security key. Keep both of these handy. So what you're going to do is you're going to go over to the Sane Logic app that you're going to download from the App Store or whatever. And then once you've opened this up for the first time, they're just going to reiterate what we just did by going to Weather Underground. You're also going to set this up as a standard IoT device. You're going to connect to the Wi-Fi of that main unit, and then you're going to select its Wi-Fi to then tell it to connect to your local home Wi-Fi, which is a 2.4 requirement. You have to be on a 2.4 network. Once you're connected, then the blinking light, the blinking Wi-Fi light, is going to go solid on the main transmit unit, and you should be good to go. So then you can go over to your tablet, open up Weather Underground, go to the top left, and in that section right there, that's where you put in your unique station ID that you've got from your portal at Weather Underground. So you just can put that right into there. And then once that's in, you're live. So this is all the data that's coming off of my unique weather station from my own home. Looks a lot nicer than 
using the other one that comes in the box. And also I can see this wherever I want. Thank you for watching. And as always, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. And if you like this video, make sure to give us a thumbs up. Always helps with the ratings.